Bruce Winston. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Speaker. Recent events have shown there is a clear and urgent need to clean up our political system. So I was pleased to hear the Secretary of State say that where there is widespread support for a measure, then he will certainly look at bringing it in. So can I urge him, therefore, in the Constitutional Renewal Bill, uh, to bring forward a measure that does have widespread uh, support and indeed has already been voted for by this House, and that is to use it as an opportunity to bring in an elected House of Lords. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, it has indeed already been uh, voted on uh, by this House, uh, uh, Mr. Speaker, as has the proposal for an 80% elected House. Uh, I say to the Honourable Lady that I think we are moving, we have indeed moved to a very substantial cross-party consensus on this issue, as illustrated by the uh, white paper I published last July. Uh, but whilst I think there are some measures we can introduce in the remainder of this Parliament, I think in this stage of this Parliament, to conduct a full-blooded root and branch reform of the House of Lords, unless uh, we had full support from all sides, uh, would be uh, pushing it. John Hippo. 